today we are going to assemble the Maker Fire four wheel robot smart car chassis kit car model with speed encoder for Arduino. This is what the package looks like when you get it. It's all wrapped in plastic. Just make sure you have all the parts. <clears throat> I'm not going to go through it here. I think the first thing, first thing we want to do probably is solder the wires onto the motors. So this kit does require soldering uh, and the ability to know how to solder, which is a skill that a lot of people have never developed. And it's a pretty challenging skill um, to do it right. So I'm going to show you how to do it right. Here's the motor and you can see the two terminals uh, where the power comes in. Now they're not marked with polarity uh, because you can switch polarity when you have polarity like plus and minus the motor shaft will turn one direction you have plus and minus, the motor shaft will turn the other direction. So, um, we have red and black wires so that at least we know uh, that uh, when we hook it up um, that we can test and see what the polarity is. Uh, also, the motors can mount on the car like this or they come out on the car like this and so when you do mount on the car like this forward is a different polarity than when you mount the motor on the car like this so there are lots of different ways to get it wrong <laughs> or, or get it right uh, in fact there is no right or wrong it's just a matter of polarity and mounting so what I suggest is that we put the red and black wires on the same way for every motor uh, and then we will uh, fix the polarity when we wire the motors up to the H bridge. There are lots of different ways you can fix the polarity after the wires are soldered on and connected to the H bridge. It can be done in software as well. So, um, a couple of things to note about soldering on this motor. You have to be very careful not to melt this plastic, clear plastic piece because it's holding the motor into the... So, the motor shaft has a little gear on it and then inside this yellow piece here it takes the motor of speed, which is normally very fast, it would be like spinning this shaft around really fast, and then it, this is a gearbox which gears it down so that you can get better traction and control the speed better. So when we solder, we got to be careful not to melt this plastic piece. Um, So here's the wire and there's the motor. Um, I'm going to put the red wire on the top, assuming this is the top. Now the, the wires, the wires will, will, you'll want those to go towards the inside of the chassis. So we're going to have the terminals here. We're going to put the wheel on this side and the wheel encoder on this side. Um, so I'm going to wire this red wire to this top solder lug here. 